that was a uh, Vlad Armstrong is here. My last challenge was 100 daily ops in a row, and I've completed it this morning, like 30 45 minutes ago. This time, I've decided to go live, and I was playing for 18 hours 48 minutes, and YouTube allows to publish a live stream no longer than 12 hours. So, sadly, there is nothing to see actually on my channel. But I've got results, and in this video, I want to share with you. Just in case, this is the last thing I have from my live stream. And yeah, if you go to this long, long video, you will see that. Okay, yes, in Spanish. But you can't see it, it's not possible to see this long video. Okay, so thank you for watching and another big thank you for 800 subs. I really appreciate it. So without any further ado, let's check this video. Let's check the rewards I've got from this long run. Thank you. Here we go. Okay, let's open Pip Boy. I got this amount of fuel, minus 1k, I started the challenge piece. Okay, here 7k caps and 790 scripts. I believe I had like 40 scripts before the run, so the final number would be like 750, right? Speaking of caps, time to time my teammates were giving me some extra for completing their events. All these camps I have got from daily ops, anything but redways and steam packs was given me by the final boss, I believe, as an extra reward. Hmm, I mean from his loot, right? <laughs> Look at this amount of redways and steam packs. OMG. And now let's move to more important stuff. First I go with armor, right? I will scroll up the whole list and I want to show you some results. Here they are, by the way. Okie dokie. I have gotten 28 power armor pieces and 25 normal armor pieces. As well you can see the amount of pieces per amount of stars and percentage from the total number of legendary items I got, including weapons of course. I've heard that in 25% of chances you will get legendary power armor and sadly it is true. Okay, weapons and first let me show you the nicest role I actually got from doing daily ops. And here it is. Executioner's faster fire rate Z pixel. Half of rewards were weapons, and thank God I got more free star legendary weapons than one star or two star. Just in case, check the amount of grenades I got. I used some trying to solve this stuck into the wall mob issue, but enemies were resilient, means I could kill them only with melee damage. Ugh. It was unbelievably stupid, my bad. Okay, overall, I got almost the same amount of legendary items for every amount of stars, meaning that for 3 star legendary reward the chances are equal, and only Iron Jesus knows what you will get. Thank you for being on my stream, and big thanks to this guy for helping me out to do some daily ops fast. Thank you for watching this video and subbing my channel. 1k is somewhere close, right? Okay, I'll see you later.